It's Saturday night, and I'm Pastor Rick Jones. We come now to the season of year that we remember the death of our Lord Jesus on that old rugged cross. Apostle Paul said, I will glory in the cross. Jesus said, if any man will come after me, let him deny himself, take up his cross, and follow me. I heard recently of a man who had been able to visit Christians on the run in northern Iraq, running from ISIS and the Islamic army there. He said he went into those villages in the mountains and discovered such incredible poverty, great need, hungry people, living in conditions that were very difficult. But he said what captured his attention most was that in the front of every one of those little dwellings, the people had put a cross. And some had put a great big cross. It was almost bigger than the place they were living in. That cross meant something to them. They knew people who had died because of that cross. They themselves had lost their homes their livelihood, their jobs. They'd lost it all to stand for the cross. And I think about what Christ has done for me. I pray that I would be found faithful, glorying in the cross, cherishing that cross. John W. Peterson paints a beautiful picture in this hymn. Out from Yes. 
how can we thank you enough for carrying that cross for us? And how we pray, Lord, that we would take up our cross now, die to this world, live only to do the will of the Father. We thank you, Lord, for all that you've done for us in Christ at the cross. And we would ask you, Lord Jesus, that you would encourage those who are carrying the cross, and perhaps it's heavier today than it has been. Perhaps there's persecution, a special trial, an extra difficulty. May they be very aware of the presence of the Lord Jesus with them, who knows exactly the road they're on, and knows also that the cross with all of its pain and all of its agony and all of its suffering and finally even death itself is not the end for there is a glorious resurrection a new life that is ours in Christ encourage those that have been discouraged strengthen the weak we pray save the lost and build us up in our holy faith sanctifying believers we pray in the name above every name the name of Jesus we pray, amen and amen.